Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcoming you to episode 13 of Let's Play Secret of Mana Blind, and I have a little bit of a stuffy doze, so, um, excuse me if my commentary isn't great, but I just really want to record this right now, so this might turn out to be a horrible episode just because of that, but I don't know, we'll find out. Anyway, so I'm in the castle of Pandora right now, because thanks to a helpful tip left by, let me see, what did I write down here, um... Jowzow87 or Jozo87, I don't know, like Jozo87, I guess. Uh, he told me that I can head back here to the king's treasure room and it should be open now that I've done that whole thing with Thanatos. This is the treasure house, I must guard it for the night of legend. Well, it doesn't appear to be open yet, dude, so I don't know what you're talking about. Maybe, some, maybe it's the other room that the guy wouldn't let me into before? Let's see, or maybe I have to talk to the king, I'm not sure. Um... Hmm. Alright, my guess is that I have to talk to the king or else the dude was just wrong in the comments. Let's see. Hello? You did it, Targon! Brightness is returning to normal everywhere! What Gemma said about you was the and the Mana Sword was true. We must now part with our treasure. We've guarded for these for we've guarded these for centuries for you, wielder of the Mana Sword. Oh boy, it actually Okay, so it actually is open, sweet. I was about to accuse you, Mr. Man, oh my god. Let's see what we got here. We got lots of loot to pick up. 50 GP, not too bad. Let's just see how valuable this treasure store is. Is it, are, are all these going to be 50 GP? That would be hilarious if they are. Well, it's three for three. I was kind of hoping for some like awesome like armor or something, but I don't know. Oh, well. Beggars can't be choosers, can they? Let's see. Alright, one more. Oh, Spears or Oh, well, <laughs> apparently it was a good idea to come here then, because Spears one of my main weapons, too. And Swords Orb. Oh, shit. Damn. Okay, I guess I better, uh... It was definitely a good thing to come here, man. Funny that those were the last two chests that I looked in. Oh, and he just has the same stuff. What about the Queen here? Does she say anything new? Thank you. Please come back. We are all... We all welcome you here in Pandora. Sweet. Alright, and uh, another tip that Jozo87 left is that there should be a new piece of armor available in the shop here, so I'm going to go ahead and check that out. I'll meet you down there. Alright, let's see about this. I'm not sure. He said this guy was zombified before, but I don't think it was. I, maybe he was, I don't know. Let's see. Candy, wristband, kung fu suit. Oh, I don't really see anything. I think we already have the kung fu suit. Well, actually, no, we have the Kung Fu dress, which I think is better. Maybe he meant another shop. I'm just going to search around a little bit of this town and just see what I can find anyways. So, uh, I'll splice in whatever I find interesting. Oh, was it this shopkeeper? Okay, I just walked into this house, and this is a different shopkeeper. Don't remember him, so maybe. Let's see. Candy. Cobra bracelet. That sounds new. Power wrist. Uh, all this other stuff I think we've heard of before. Oh, the Kung Fu dress is here now, too. Well, that's good. I should probably buy some more of this stuff, too. So let me just see about this. This is for everyone, so I guess I'll buy three of those up. He says it only cre increases defense by one, but I figure, like, why not? And, uh, let me just see how much candy and stuff I can buy. Might as well load up while I'm here. It's very cheap, so... Man, did I seriously... Oh, okay, I thought I needed, like, four more candies. I didn't really need to buy that herb, but... Whatever. Uh, and that should be good. Now let me just equip all this crap. Let's see. Let's see just how much better it is. Uh, there we go. Wait, no. Oh, but yeah, I have to go to this. Duh, I haven't equipped something in so long. I'm so stupid. Oh, let's see here. Four to six. That's pretty good. And what about uh, you, buddy? Edge, my buddy, old pal, old friend. Let's see. Four to six. Good. And Sydney... You too, I imagine four to six. So it should decrease increase by Yep, there we go. Well that's just Jim Dandy, isn't it? And I guess uh, really quick I'll sell these things. Alright, so really quick I think I'm just gonna check in in a few different places. Well actually just one different place. Uh where is that place? Is it this house next to the shop here? It might be. I don't totally remember. It's where the old man lives. I wanna see if he says anything different now that we've like seen Fana and stuff. Oh no, Fana, oh please, Fana. Oh no, he said just, oh Fana. Okay, well that was kind of sad, but 
He does have different dialogue, so I was technically right. And on that, I think I will save really quick. Hell yeah. Because I don't want to have to fight that freaking wall face again, good lord. Oh my god. Yeah, a lot of you were saying, like, Pix Caliber and uh, some other people, you were saying that I should be, that I should have been waiting for my thing to recharge 100% until I attacked again, and that's right, I probably should have, I was just all caught up in the battle, I didn't realize what I was doing. Or something like that, I guess, I don't know. Either way, I've learned my lesson now. Anyways, um, so I think Gemma told us to go back up to see Luca, is that right? But I also... Well, I guess the warp to near Guy's Naval is up by Water Palace anyways, so I'll go meet up with Luca, and then we'll go back to Guy's Naval to get these orbs infused and stuff. So, uh, see ya. You know something I just realized, guys? I thought I'd talk about this as I'm just perusing through the Water Palace here. Is that talking about what you're going to do after a cut, right before a cut... It's just totally pointless, cause they're gonna, cause you're gonna see it anyways in the frickin' video. But I've been doing that like all my life, all my LP and career. It just like feels awkward to not say anything before cut, so I guess that's why I do it. But I don't know, I might stop doing that. I just kind of realized that it was kind of an epiphanic moment. I don't know if that's a word actually. Anyways, here's Luca. Um, the man seat of water was stolen. I couldn't do anything about. Seriously? What? How did you? Did you at least see who did it? I should hope so. They must have done it with, done it when Undyne was in danger and out of power. The water tells me they took it to Guy's navel. Oh well, or deeper. Okay, well, oh uh, that could that's on our way at least. So I don't think they are from the Empire. Please hurry and bring it back. Will do. So they're not they're not part of Thanatos's thing. So who could they be then? There can't are there multiple antagonists here? Oh God, I don't even want to fathom that. Then again, stranger things have happened. Oh, sweet. Edge's magic went up on 9 level 1. Sweet. Guess I should show that on the way. Job, it's petrified. Oh, yeah, that's also my first time using a stone saber. I've never used it before. So I guess I can just see. Yeah. I guess it just petrifies the enemy. I'm not sure exactly what that does. I guess it just turns them to stone. That would make sense. God, whoever thought of the secret passageway here is brilliant. Brilliant game designer. Oh, God. Except for that long-ass staircase. It's a little bit too long. I mean, can't they just take us right here? She just walked across lava, didn't you see that? God. Alright, so we got two things to fuse here. We got our sword and our spear. Both the our, their second orbs, I think they are. So that should make them all the more... Oh, we actually have a third. I forgot about the bow. Good lord. Man, let's see. So now it's the short bow. What's the sword's name? It's the Herald Sword. God. I can... I know Herald is uh, in the Sprite's spear. Convenient. I know Harold is supposed to be like a really epic and monumental word, but I, I like know this guy named Harold, and he's like a he's like a pretty big nerd. I'm not gonna lie about that. It's just so whenever I hear that word, instead of thinking, "Oh, that's so cool and royal and stuff," I think of this like nerdy guy with like these big glasses, and it just totally ruins it for me. So it's just like, oh. Uh. Of course, I guess they're not spelled the same way, like Harold and. Herald aren't spelled the same way, the name and the word. But it's, it's still just the sound, the onomatopoeia is just ridiculous. Anyways, what am I talking about? Uh, so we gotta go... Lucas said to go deeper than Guy's Navel, so I'm guessing the only place I know that's deeper than Guy's Navel so far is the Earth Palace. Is this gem over here? There is gem over here. Oh, uh-oh, what the... What did I just do? Um... Did I step onto a warp of some kind? I, I didn't see what I did. But apparently I'm here now. And I'm not sure where here is. This is very industrial looking though. Oh, there's a chest. A chest, you may. Leave it alone. You'll never see it again. The whip's orb. Wow. Getting orbs left and right here. I can't hear the music very well. I'm going to turn it up really quick. God, I sound so phlegmy. What the hell? Aha, the water seed. Who said that? How'd you get in here? You realize we can't let you leave. What are you guys in your long legs? Boss? Just boss? Okay. Welcome! We the Scorpion Army will rule the world! Check it out. Shut up! We took the water seed! To complete our super deluxe robot, we call it Kilroy. 
clever. Hubba hubba! Do it! Aye aye, sir! I have no idea what voices I give these I'm just giving the most random voices ever. So I can't move. Oh wait, now I can. Can I leave then? No, I better follow them. They have the water seed, and that's kind of what we're here for, so... Aw, oh, shit. Go get them now! See ya, farewell, goodbye, children! Aye, what's wrong? Oh, uh, I, I keep getting my voices confused. Too much energy, it's out of control! No, remove the seed, use the auxiliary power! Uh-oh, okay. So we got a robot on our hands here. Uh, I'm guessing I should be using undyne then because water would short circuit a robot right let's just see about this i'm not going to start trying to chain spells until i'm sure okay 78 i guess i'll just test to see how much gnome does in comparison let's go 71 so they're about the same i guess so it doesn't really matter all things considered oh no god damn he's doing his big flaily crap all right, let's see if I can start... Uh, Sydney's Moogle? Seriously? Goddamn. Okay, let's see if I can tr start trying to chain these spells. Uh, I'm gonna start trying to actually... I think I'm gonna try with uh, Gnome instead. From what I saw in someone's video response, uh, what you're supposed to... Crap, I think I might have messed that up. What you're supposed to do to chain spells is wait until the elemental disappears, like the elemental, and elemental creature, like the Gnome there when he disappeared. Wait till he disappears and then cast it again, and that's supposed to work. I think I'm doing it right there. Oh, I think... No, maybe not. I don't know, I couldn't really tell if that worked, to be honest with you. Uh, let's see, though. I do need to heal up a little bit, I think. Boom! Let's even charge something up here for an attack. God, this Kilroy is slow. Oh, wait. Oh, watch out! How does, he, how does she get moogled like that? That's so weird. Like, does he is he actually casting magic spells? Oh, we're all moogled. Maybe it's that stupid, just whirly thing. Maybe that's what causes the moogling. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, uh, shoot. There we go. There we go. This guy's so funny. He's so fu He, like, reminds me of Robo. Okay, Kilgore gets whacked. Yes. Kilgore gets whacked. I don't know, that's just fun to say it like that. Oh shit, Sydney died. How could I let that happen? I'm so careless. Oh, let's see here. At least I got four cups of wishes. That's always a good thing, right? There we go. Hell yeah. Alright, Kilroy, you get out of here. Do I have to hit him in the back? Is that, like, the idea here? Because there's something protruding from his backside there. Edge seat. Crap. Oh my god, I'm just letting them die left and right here. That might be what I have to, because that looks really like it's just just huge protrusion in his back. So you'd think that would be a weak point. If I know video games, because all video games are the same, of course. Well, I guess I should be casting more magic. I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, let's cast some cure water on all of us, and then help. And then I'll have Edge. Uh, use some more of his magic too. How much more magic does he have? He has two MP left. That's enough for one more spell, if I can navigate these menus correctly. Good lord. You know what this guy actually kind of reminds me of more than Robo is an Armos. Just because he's got that thing in his back and... I mean, sure, Armos aren't on unicycles. They don't have these wildly flailing hammers that just... Oh, well, he's dead. Sweet, and someone leveled up there, I think. I heard that. Oh yeah, off screen in case I don't show it, uh, Edge's magic with Undyne leveled up. So that's cool. Hell yeah, look at us celebrating all pre- We were probably celebrating the whole time during that explosion too. That's just funny to think about. Way to go! Hell yeah. The Javelin's orbs, so that's two more orbs that I have. Good lord. Nuts! Oh well, see ya, bye! Recover the mana seeds! We gotta take that back to Luca, I guess. Let's bring it back to the water palace, hell yeah. Oh wait, oh, I went back to here, I didn't want to go back to here. How do I get out? Shit. Is there like a warp there that I'm not seeing or something? This is some rock and music at least though, to be lost to. I can't believe I'm getting stuck on this of all things. This is retarded. 
Okay, what's the point of this? Well, that works, I guess. I'm just using the magic rope, sure. I, I couldn't figure out any other way to get out of there, guys. I'm being completely honest. It was probably right in front of my face the whole frickin' time. But I'm just too stupid to see it, I guess. Uh, so let's see. We've got two more of these things ready. We got the whip to go. Nice. That's his first orb. So we get the black whip. Scary. And uh, the pole dart. Is that, the, is that right? Oh, yeah. I guess javelin. Yeah. And yeah, now it's a javelin. Good f figures. Alright, uh, I might do a bit of weapon rearranging, because someone else, I, I'm sorry, I can't remember your name, I should have written it down like I did with the other guy, Jozo87, or Jowza, whatever. But, uh, he said that the way he plays, he, like, recommends switching up the weapon sometimes, and that seems like a good idea anyways, in terms of a let's play. So I might do a bit of weapon switching, I'm just gonna see what's available right now, so, uh, yeah. Okay, guys, and I was just checking it, too. Uh, when I leveled up in that boss, I think this was Edge that leveled up to 13, because I think he was level 12 a second ago. And um, as for the weapons I changed, just because I'm here now anyways, uh, I gave Argon the load axe and Sydney the short bow. Edge still has the spear, because that's significantly better than all the other items for him, basically. Uh, yeah. Wait, what did that say? It said Lullabud spaced out there for- and I swear I saw a balloon. I'm not sure what happened there, um... Maybe nothing. I'll probably splice this part in really quick just to show you guys, but... If anyone could explain that, feel free. You must whip it. Oh god, oh what the hell? Why are there monsters here now? Shit! Something bad happened? I hope Luca's okay. Oh no. Dude, die! I know I'm attacking you on the staircase, but still. See, I don't know what that is. That's spacing out. And before I attacked someone with the whip and it said they got tangled? I don't know. I'm guessing that's just a side effect of some of these weapons. Shit! Oh no. These guys- I knew those guys in that stupid ship that I couldn't escape from wouldn't give up so easily. Whoever they were. Boss and the gang. Alright, I actually didn't heal up Edge's magic, so I, yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, I really should have. I was stupid. Water, water thug. Okay. You look like cheap cheeps. Imitation knockoff cheap cheeps. Who leveled up? Edge is level 14. So I guess that wasn't Edge that leveled up before. But oh well. Some will level up or something. I don't know. In that boss fight, I know I heard the sound effect. So. All right, Luke, are you okay? Come on. Tell me. Oh shit! What are you? Get out of here fast! Gesh, Gestar? Who have we here? I'm Gestar of the Empire. Hand over that seer, Lucas had it. Lucas hat, that's a weird way of saying it. Don't! What? Oh, shit. Oh, God. I don't know, Lucas telling me not to, but my better judgment tells me. Because I could, I could kick these guys. Oh, God, I could kick these guys' ass for sure and get it back eventually, right? Oh god, this is scary, scary choice. Ah, oh, I'm gonna hand it over. Let's see, atta boy. Let's see what's gonna happen now. So glad the seeds here. Too bad we have to break the seal. Stop it. Well, nice to have met you all. So what was all that about? Uh oh. Remember my little pet? Remember to feed him? That's like the third time I've heard that in this freaking game. Whoa. That was some creepy music there.